the side are put in place new security measures while threatening existing security apparatus. The carefully reviewed security strategies, coupled with the administrative and operational strategies, consciously put in place to keep this place safe for law abiding residents and uncomfortable for criminals. Criminal elements have led to the modest but laudable achievements recorded at the last quarter of the year. Some of these criminal elements were arrested for offenses ranging from conspiracy and armed robbery, courtesy, murder, stealing, unlawful possession of firearms, unlawful possession of human parts, cyber crimes, and operating illegal security outfits. Exactly that of the Major Navy, and the other one that calls itself the Security Foundation at Kurudu, which has turned up to be a, a cannibal venue where people are tortured to death and shallow grave. So, thank you all there. So, now, so Mr. Su are to give residents helpless minds were equally arrested during the intelligence raid of criminal hype routes across the states. Also, a catch of arms and ammunition, cartridges, stolen vehicles, motorcycles, criminal charms, human parts, military accountants, and other exhibits were recovered during the period. Many of the suspects have been charged to court after conclusion of our investigation. However, there are so many other ones that still remain. But I'm not going to bore you with this in respect to cops, that's the low position of human health. That's when we are arrested. On 7 December 2021 at 11.30 a.m., a suspended ritualist. So by name, Kola Wali Sikiro, age 41, was arrested with French man parts, which is feared from a body at a cemetery. The suspect of her, upon interrogation, confessed to have dug a grave at Savo Cemetery, Bobo Road. So equally, we have suspended armed robber, unnapped with arms and ammunition on 10 December, also, another illegal security outfit posted. That is based on a credible intelligence gathered. The tenters attached to the Chagamro Police Division in Kurudu posted a camp of an illegal security outfit called itself Citizens for Peace and First Aid Mission of Nigeria. That's the name. Citizens for Peace and First Aid Mission of Nigeria where innocent citizens were arrested, detained, and tortured. Investigation to the activities revealed that this illegal fit was recruiting and training young Nigerians who were kitted with uniform and accountability similar to those of government security agencies in Nigeria. So the case is still ongoing. We arrested the traditional list, that's the upper list, which they use in Sifiani, vital parts of human body for rituals. That outfit now is at Kurudu. They recruit, train, and deploy the men as security guards to many establishments, including private and corporate work. Just like we said, away were in those of the merchant navy. That to see them kitted, dressed, and even training in the paramilitary outfit. And many people, many members of the public, don't feel that they are not government agencies. So that's why I keep on appealing to members of the public. When you see people that literally dress in uniforms, <clears throat> I want to engage them for whatever security services. Please, an appeal. Go extra mile in investigating the existence, the legality of such an outfit. Because most of them put on the uniform, in order to get access to the companies, to individuals, privacy, and cause havoc. That's what I've been. Just like another incident where an housemate drugged at the cherry area. So, drug a principal when she was serving out with the food. The woman also suddenly ate the food with happiness, only for her to sleep off. By the time she woke up, all her. Uh, Trinklets have been packed away. 
and the lady disappeared into the thin air. But we succeeded in getting those who gave her because that woman now did a little investigation. <clears throat> Somebody gave the house help to her. So I'm appealing to members of the public. Don't let us leave, look at the cheapness of the services to be provided by our domestic staff. I just go ahead and pick them. Try to do the needful. And what's the needful? Get the background information of who these people are. Who can we pick? Who can we construct? Who can we console if there's anything? Always get security and personal aid, domestic staff that have thread in their needles to be traced. A needle without the trace will miss in the middle of anything. But what we tread, can use the trainer to trace it out. Let us take extra time to ensure that whoever that's coming closer to us is the person that we can not only vouch for, both medically, both security wise, but certainly that if something happens now, we can't be traced. So <clears throat> that's about that. Conspiracy, arm robbery of a no possession of firearms, ammunition. So I don't want to go into all this because I'm giving you a couple of this. So I just read out the summary. And in <clears throat> like an appreciation that the gentlemen of the press, we appreciate your support. <clears throat> and equally appreciate the support of members of the public who have been very cooperative by way of giving credible information that led to the arrest of the suspect and others not captured in this briefing. The achievements we made could not have been possible but for the support of the state governor and the people of Lagos State. Not only that, the future leadership and sense of direction given to all the personnel of this command at all times by our amiable, amiable Strategic General of Police, IGP Al-Kali Baba Osman, PSC Daga, FDC, NPM, deserves our commendation and appreciation. The logistic support given by the governor and the Spotted General Police is a motivating factor that has always propelled us towards greater commitments. We want to once again reassure all residents of Lagos State of our unwavering commitment to the fight against criminals in the states. Not minding the circumstances or the challenges, it is our collective resolve to strictly maintain law and order and make the state safer for law-abiding citizens. As we review our security architecture regularly to provide watertight security through consistent proactive approaches and living by stop and search, motorized patrol of every part of the mainland and waterways in the states, let me sound a note of warning to all criminal elements who are either domiciled in the state or who sometimes sneak into Lagos from neighboring states to perpetrate their nefarious acts. Lagos still will not be safe ever for criminals. This I stand by and this we shall maintain. We will not allow criminal activities to fester in Lagos states. Lagos states have been and still remain the safest in this country. That I'm proud to say, and we shall do everything within the habits of the law to sustain that status. The robust security arrangement put in place in the state before the expanse, which resulted in the relative peace enjoyed through the period, are still in place. The officers and men deployed to maintain law and order and provide adequate security for all negotiations during the expanse will not abdicate their duty, post, and responsibility to protect lives and properties of everyone during the new time, the new year, and beyond. Let me also use this video to admonish parents and guardians to warn their children against the use of crackers and other explosive fireworks while celebrating the new year. Although we cannot stop merrymakers from celebrating, we urge them to make moderation their watchword and guiding principle during this festive period. Similarly, merchants of such digital fireworks are advised to stop selling them in the interest of peace and security 
in the States. This is Amatan period. Any slightest thing that can ignite fire, we we'll have to avoid it. And fireworks is one of that. And the fireworks of today, the sound of fireworks of today, even sounds louder than our own rivals, which now gives fear to the the public that there is illegal acts or there's robbery going on. So many times we have been called, not only me, the control rooms, as well as senior officers have been called. Robbery going on here, robbery here. By the time we get there now, we discover it's a main issue of fireworks being used. So we appeal seriously. So I need to appreciate it has gone down just carry this year, unlike other years. There has never been any house that has been caught by fire because of this, but we need to sustain this so that we go to the new year now with happy minds and resources. So all oh, the judgment of the press, my coming to Lagos, my stay in Lagos, my sources in Lagos has not been without your cooperation, without your support. From the first day I came into the command, I realized that you are the first set that the hosted will entertain and exchange pleasant, pleasantry. Since then, it has been no going back in my relationship. So the fraternity, the personal, the official one that will be going now, I want you now to extend this to whoever is coming to take over from me, the leadership of the Ghost Police Command. I've done my bit, I've played my part, and I thank God for support.